And, uh, obviously, I did some arms, but I did a full back workout prior. A lot of pull downs, trying to work on the width. And uh, I'm going to do back twice this week. Probably going to do back twice a week for the next month. And each month, I'm probably going to do one particular body part twice a week. So this month, it's going to be back. Next month, probably be legs. And then September, so on and so forth. But I uh, got got five exercises today. Uh, a back, like I said, a lot of pull downs, different grips, wide, narrow, underhand, overhand, behind the neck. I did one set of seated seated uh, cable row. Actually, it was a, it was a, not even cable. It was a. Uh, Seated row using a hoist machine. Not necessarily my go-to, but definitely something that I think I got a really good squeeze. Um, I'm coming back to Vegas, baby. <laughs> I am coming back to Vegas. This December 16th and 17th. I know you guys heard, seen the post. Very, very excited. Extremely excited. Shout out to Olympia. Jake Wood, Dan Solomon, the whole group. Um, got me so fired up I'm in the gym filming for you guys and uh, got a lot of cool things coming up uh, I'm just very very thankful that I have you guys to be on this journey with me so um, sweating sort of like a storm sweating sort of like a savage in here Whew. probably from all the extra carbs I've been eating <laughs> from all the good from all the good meals but uh, I don't know is there any questions on there, Ben? Anything from the fans? They're just saying they, they love you and you're the best. Oh, well, thank you very much. You guys are the best. You guys have been um, definitely a driving force throughout my entire career. Oh, and are you going to be at the Transcend booth? Yes, I'm going to be at the Transcend booth. That is primarily the only booth I'm going to be at, um, the Olympia weekend. Uh, so I'm really, really excited to be a part of that uh, because Transcend is the industry leader in uh, wellness and uh, all the different uh, medicines that they carry. And the emphasis of getting your blood work done is so important. So for anyone that wants to know more, you know, hit a Transcend and uh, they, they're going to take very well care of you and, and your loved ones. Oh, man. Sweating so hard is like burning my eyes. <laughs> but, uh, Anybody guessing my weight right now, I weighed in at 260 pounds today. So I'm pretty happy about that. Um, Shri wants to keep me at that weight as much as possible. So I'm gonna oblige that and I'm gonna just try to refine this 260 pounds. Um, so I'll probably get down to like a good 250 come Olympia time. Connie said, Cam said, kill it. <laughs> what do you think of that, Cam? <laughs> and, that's the, and that's the bad art. <laughs> oh man. I, uh, I feel pretty awesome, can't lie. And the gym has been so therapeutic for my own personal development, obviously, but not just on stage, but just in life. Uh, these weights don't lie, man. The 80 pounds is still the 80 pounds, no matter 
if you're having a good day or a bad day, it's all about how you address it in your mind and in your spirit. Um, you know, I've been traveling a lot more, and just to be able to meet and greet a lot of you guys and hear your stories, that's what I'm really excited about. <laughs> that's what I'm really excited about, is hear more of your guys' stories of triumph. But also hear your stories of pain, because um, it, pain is something that we all go through. And what's really cool about the gym is that we all experience it in different levels. But in the gym, we definitely experience pain. Um, and here it's more physical, but deep down, it's a lot more spiritual and emotional than you can ever imagine. And I'm sure you, if you guys think about it long and hard, um, you'll, you'll think of those moments where you're you know, battling with something. But it's really, really important that you know that you're not freaking out about it. You know, and you have all these amazing weights to help you grow mentally, physically, and emotionally. Um, oh, man. Got any more questions, Banks? No? Yeah. Everybody was just being super cool? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I love you guys, man. I guess I hit a front double line yeah. and then... Uh, speak louder, though. Oh, speak louder. I'm, I'm thinking this is like a church, being all quiet. So, I am going to hit a front double bicep for you guys because I think it's really cool. <laughs> I mean, I'm being all. Well. <laughs> so I'm wondering, I'm wondering what they measure in at. It probably should still be at 22 and a half. But what I'm really trying to focus on is getting more of these striations in the rear delts. I'm trying to get that more pronounced. So I'm going to be doing a lot of, a lot of delts this week too. Um, what are we, about six months out, babe, from yep. the Olympia? Mm -hmm. Pretty much officially, six yep. months out. So I hope every person in every category that is going through it right now trains even extra hard. Um, not that, not just that I'm going to be there, but because it means something. The Olympia is the pinnacle of bodybuilding. It's the pantheon of all in all of fitness. Um, you have all these different events, different divisions. Uh, men and women get to really showcase their their body of work and. I think it's really important that we as fans, because I'm a fan of the sport, whether I was competing or not, um, is to show support for our favorites and just for the sport itself. Because the sport itself actually helps a lot of these men and women earn a living, but more importantly, uh, battle through life. And to, in return, the, the, the positivity that we provide our favorite athletes gets them that extra rep, that extra set, that extra step in that cardio, and even that extra ounce of chicken breast for broccoli that they freaking hate, <laughs> but they hate to love it because of you guys. So I, for one, commend all of the athletes, but um, I cannot wait to see all you guys' faces, man, and all the fans, man. I'm so pumped. Someone asked, do you remember coming to Okinawa, Japan, military base? Of course. I, I went to Kadena. Air Force yeah. Base in Okinawa mm -hmm. and I was there for an Armed Forces event and needless to say I saw some of the most ripped people in my freaking life and um, they were actually not the Americans it was the Okinawans that were just super ripped I remember meeting quite a few of them and I was like what are you guys doing they're like we're eating fish all the time man we're just like eating all this lean protein all the time but uh, I lastly, had a great time. Lastly, they want to know what what's your weight again? My weight? Yeah. Uh, my weight. Um, well, my weight today was 262. So I'm trying to get up to 265. I ain't gonna lie. So I got three more pounds, and I'm gonna try to refine that, and then come bring it down. Normally, I get up to 280, but that's not happening, right, babe? Nope. <laughs> but uh, yeah. Well, we'll get you get home and have another meal. Let's see. Back up. <laughs> Uh, so, well, thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for your ongoing support. Much love to each and every one of you. Hopefully, you guys are doing extremely well. If not, you can always change it around with your mindset. Always focus on three things training hard, training smart, and of course, having fun. All right, God bless you all. Peace.